There are a couple ways, I think, to, to look at your stats. I think um, most people will just focus on what are my weaknesses, I wanna work on those. I also think it's very important to work really hard on, on your strengths because if you don't have strengths, then you're not any good. So that's, I mean, uh, greens and regulation is always a good stat for me. Kirk is ranked inside the top 50 on tour in greens and regulation at just under 67%. In addition, he's number one this season in total holeouts with 20. Kirk's elite iron game can partly be attributed to his swing coach, Mark Love, the brother of Davis Love III. Most of the stuff that Mark and I, I work on is very just kind of basic fundamentals type of thing. I've always been a real field player, and when I start hitting the bat, it's the same problem every time I get the club stuck underneath a little bit and, and hit blocks to the right or, or flip hooks. And so it's just trying to keep the club in front of me. You hear people say that all the time. Keep the club in front of me, keep it on plane, and then just work on my timing a little bit. But I do a lot of drills with Mark, and they're all Davis Love Jr. drills. I've kind of modeled my swing after Davis a little bit. He has a, a big turn, but doesn't get the club to parallel, and then just a nice smooth tempo. I think that helps a lot with your distance control. I sweep it a little bit more, and my distance control is a strength. In turn, makes my iron play a strength. Weeks when I'm driving it well and I'm hitting the fairway, because I, I'm a good iron player, golf becomes a lot easier. You know, I can still sort of scrape it around and I can get it around when I'm not driving that great usually because I can hit some really good iron shots and hit a few close and kind of make up for some of my mistakes. I try to work on just hitting fairways and go from there.